the Hilton Head National RV Resort. We got the whole fam jam here. What's up? We're here on a little vacation from Christmas to New Year's. And we're excited because we've never camped at this campground before. And we have all the dogs, four dogs, a baby, four adults. What could go wrong? Our spots 225 and 226. And this place is beautiful. Awesome private view of the bike trail right across from us. And we're about to walk the campground for the first time this morning to just go for a tour because we got in super late last night due to snow and all kinds of other things that we had to go through. So let's go check everything out. today touring the grounds, checking out the campground, relaxing. We're gonna ride our electric e-bikes a little bit later. Y'all, this place is so nice. They have all kinds of things, a dog park, the most amazing like spa resort pool that I've ever seen. And yeah, all the camp spots too are paved. What do you think? Love it. So nice. Love it. to quite a few water issues in the camper, COVID campers, you know. So the boys have been fixing those and we're just enjoying the sunshine. Have anything to say, mom? No, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Plan today is to stay around the campground. We're gonna ride our electric bikes while mom and dad walk with the baby. And then we're gonna go eat lunch at the restaurant here at the campground. We're really excited because we hear it's super, super good. And then the rest of the week, we're gonna just go on different adventures. Recently bought the electric 3.0 bikes and we absolutely love them, especially for flat campgrounds like this one. We can just ride around everywhere. We put little man on a harness so he can ride with us and these have been awesome to have on camping trips because they fold up and you can just put them in the bed of your truck or put them inside the camper. And we really, really like them.
him a ferret. <laughs> Looks like a ferret. Favorite game, Mom. Let's go. golfing because this RV resort is actually also a golf resort. So we are headed out this morning to go play. It's so pretty outside. So can't wait to show you guys the golf course because I hear it's absolutely beautiful. These camp spots all right here are literally on the golf course. They're so pretty. Play with first. You pulled out Abby first. Mm -hmm. you go first. Abby's first. You're second. John's third. <laughs> That's what you thought. <laughs> Down the middle. Who'd you use, Steven? Huh? Nobody. Nobody. All right. <laughs> All right. so far wide open flat nice course greens are just tremendous great condition they roll good highly recommend highly recommend it and it's not bad price either no it's not beautiful day beautiful day. we fell asleep on like hole two and luckily he can sleep through anything because <laughs> it's been a little bumpy but it is such a pretty day wish i could take a nap too still have a sleeping baby. We are on hole six and he's been sleeping since like hole two. But I don't blame him. It is a beautiful day. good right there though. Today we have decided to go onto Hilton Head Island. We are just right before you get on the bridge, the campground is. So we're actually gonna go onto the island, 
go check out some of our favorite places that little man has never been to and go get a really good lunch on the water. We really want some seafood. We're just gonna be touring around the beach today. It's a little bit cloudy, but it is super hot. It feels great out. So um, we're just gonna have a nice day. How'd you like it? Good, delicious. Yes. Swordfish. Yeah. Very tender, black and just perfectly. That's what we got. Very good. Oh. Do you like your low country bowl? It's good. Yeah. Very good. Gumbo was very good. Hudson's is awesome. Hudson's is like one of the best restaurants here on the island. And sorry, but I can't show you our food because we devoured it way too quickly. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Girls shopping day at South Beach. And Easton. <laughs> Not just the girls. <laughs> Wow, it's the whole rainbow. Time to go to the clubhouse for some treats. really random being that we're at the beach but this is the best mexican restaurant we've ever had do y'all like it oh the best literally the best mexican restaurant ever we've ate here twice now might be here again before we leave but y'all have to try this one if you come to hilton head mom and i and the baby <laughs> came to palmetto bluff which i've been coming to for years and years and years now Oh yeah, <laughs> it's a little bit of a rainy day, so we're just shopping and the boys are at the campground per usual, but if y'all have not been to Palmetto Bluff, you've got to come here. It is literally beautiful. This is the Montage Hotel. And then um, I'll also show you one of my favorite places, which is like downtown uh, near the water.
You wanna go home? You're going for a car ride? Is it time to go home? Happy New Year. We are both fresh out of bed and packing up to go home. And I wanted to leave everybody with a rating on these videos that we're gonna do. So I'm gonna go with um, nine. And that is because last night the bar and grill on New Year's Eve closed at 10 and I didn't love that. I wish they'd stay open longer. What about you? Eight and a half. Why? Bar and grill closed yeah. too early. And then in the bathrooms, when you took a shower, you had nowhere to sit to put on your clothes. True, true. And I went into the handicapped bathroom apparently, so that's why there was a bench, but the other bathrooms have like a glass uh, shower door, right? But the cleanness, it's 10 yeah. out of 10. Yeah, there, it's beautiful, it's clean, and we absolutely love this campground. And we're booking another trip for March. Do you guys rate this place? So I would rate this a nine. And the reason I wouldn't give it a 10 is because of the bathrooms. They need to put like a stool or seat in there so when you get done showering, you got some place to sit down and get dressed. And then also the bar and grill closes way too early. Yeah, we want New to party. Eve, yeah, New Year's Eve, it closed at 10. They at least give it till 12. But other than that, everything's great. Great campground. Mom, what do you give it? I give it a 10. Um, I've never Ooh. had a bathroom that was so nice that I would actually use that over my camper. <laughs> Um, yeah, you went there most of the time. Yep. I did. I used it every time for showering, which I've never done before. I've never showered in another place because they've never been as nice. But this is such a clean campground. The food at the Bar and Grill was great. The aesthetics were beautiful in all the clubhouses and such. I really loved it. I thought it was beautiful. Yeah. Now the dogs are. Yep, what do you guys think, Zeke and Rilla? They love it. Great walking. 10 out of 10? 10. 10 out of 10 dog park and dog wash? Oh, yeah. Two and a half mile path for them. Yeah. And they got sight 225. I hate that about those stairs. Mm -hmm. All the junk just goes inside. Lee, not a professional YouTuber, but I hope these videos help. You see the campgrounds that we go to, and the more we do them, the better we'll get. So we will see y'all next time.